Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the YouTube channel. And today we are going to be reviewing The Ring, the 2002 remake of the Japanese versions, uh, starring Naomi Watts about a killer videotape. If you haven't checked this out, I highly recommend you go check it out. It's the first time I've seen it in a very long time. It came out in 2002 and is definitely an enjoyable watch, to say the least. Enjoy. So I'm going to throw this out there straight away. If you have seen Scary Movie 3, you have seen most of this movie. So straight out the window. Um, the whole thing with the different, you know, when they take the pictures and the faces all swervy, uh, the killer videotape, you're down seven days, uh, the direct references to, like, the drawings and the classroom scene at the start, um, the lighthouse, the farm, the horses. So much happens in this film. And I, what I want to say this is, I was bored, not bored, but nothing was really happening until like they got to the island. I think that was like 30, 35 minutes left. So like an hour and 20 minutes, I think it's like a two-hour film, and I went, like an hour and 20 minutes of this film was just pure boring. Um, you know, the whole getting the phone call, trying to investigate, and just try to work out what the hell was going on. With Samara is the girl on the tape, the girl who died in the well. Aiden is the ex-husband. Uh, no, Aiden's the kid, sorry. Noah's the ex-husband, and Rachel is the main character. Rachel is an excellently portrayed character by Naomi. Uh, Noah was great. Aiden was great. The characters were great. Um, but it all just it, it all just felt like blah to me. You know, they got to the island, spoke to the dad. Dad electrocuted himself. You know, so we have all the evidence in there. So a lot of the evidence was destroyed. Um, then there was a scene where obviously they found the well, which wasn't on the island, and then. Uh, she managed to. She found the well, obviously, and then she found the dead body of Samara. And then for me, it was just if you didn't watch it properly, sorry, if, you, if you, this was your first time watching, you wouldn't explain that you're probably wondering why does Rachel live? Because apparently, you, if you make a copy, you pass it on to the next person. That's not explained. I only know that some parents explained it. But yeah, um, the visuals are okay in this. The story, I, I'm guessing, continues into The Ring 2. Noah obviously ends up getting killed at the end. They think they sort of passed it, but obviously, very sad. And I'm going to admit, it's very sad to see Noah die because he was an excellent character and there's a great... Um, um, companion, I'd say, to Rachel. Aiden did a great role. Uh, um, God. Yeah. I've got to admit, it just wasn't that good of a film pacing was slow there was bet the deaths were atrocious it literally was just zooming on the person and the face would be fucked up <laughs> um yeah so pacing was awful uh, wasn't violent at all the story was boring i just feel like the whole samara storyline didn't really get explained as much the well scene was anticlimactic uh, I thought there'd be like a proper scene where you know she would face off against a girl. Did not happen. Uh, Noah's death, you know, random. I was in a whole seven day thing, but yeah, it was just Ring is a bland, boring attempt at a horror movie. It's okay in pieces. I I love the concept. It just didn't work for me. Um... <clears throat> And I think simply because I think three people died the whole film. What, what the girl to start, Daddy who electrocuted himself, and then Noah. Uh, yeah, the girl in the mental asylum again didn't it, it was random. She disappeared in the house at the start when obviously her friend died. She hadn't watched. Um, she was in a mental asylum and then she didn't appear again. And, that woman in the the doctorate uh, just lied, and uh, it was all. I know I'm looking back at it now. The um, this is a this is awful film. I don't like this film. Now we watch for some reason why watchable. Uh, and know uh, who the other is actor is. Uh, but yeah, not a good film. Not really. I'm gonna give it like a two out of ten. This, it's not enjoyable. I'm gonna give Ring to a watch. See if it's any better. Uh, that's all I can say. Um, 
Uh, yeah, yeah, simply. That's it. Uh, let me know your let me know your thoughts on this film if you think it was better. I think there was a lot more potential for it. Maybe Ring Two is a lot better. Maybe it goes into the story a lot more. Maybe it delves into Samara's story. It just didn't do it for me. Uh, now I'm reflecting more on it. It just didn't sell it for me. Uh, the island scene is the best part of the film, but other than that, it just isn't that good of a film. So anyway, thanks for watching. Let me know what you thought down below. Let me know if Ring Two is any better without any spoilers. Rings, I know, was atrocious when I watched that, but I will give that a watch as well. But anyways, until the next one, thanks for watching. Take care for now. Goodbye.